guys welcome back to Shah's lifestyle vlogs today's been quite a busy day oh my hair's falling out i'm gonna have to fix that before work right so i done my first shift at work this morning and then i went straight to the gym please disregard any mess that you can or cannot see because my place is a bit of a mess right now anyway we have a haul today guys um a shopping haul i went a little bit ham as far as our fruit and veg if you watched my previous haul please refer back to my last grocery haul you will see that i say i didn't get enough fruit and veg which i didn't so i went a little bit crazy let's go and start this haul because i do have to go to work today as i said disregard any mess that you can see my um my actual kitchen is a state please disregard that also i've had to put my shopping on both sides of my countertops right here um as i said i went a little bit ham guys this is my fridge right here and as you can see it's a very small fridge that doesn't hold a lot of fresh um fresh foods so like it's really hard um we are hoping to get a new non non-frost fridge freezer and they can take away this fridge don't know when that's going to happen i will keep you lot posted but we're doing that because our health it's all to do with our health it's not really because we want a non-frost fridge it's because the fridge that we have is so small it's more for a one or two people it's not really for a family so i do want to get a big fridge an actual big fridge freezer not even big average size and we have seen one that we all really like so myself and my girls are going to hopefully be able to chip in together and get that but for now we have to deal with having a very small fridge um and that does sort of hinder my shopping a little bit somewhat because i can't get sorry guys i'm straight out of the shower um so my hair's a mess everything is a mess but i am dressed to go back to work so let's get back with these this let's get to this haul guys let's do this really quickly please as i said disregard any pots pans plates and so on because my kitchen needs well i've got a few dishes that i need to be doing so please disregard that okay let's start okay so first of all we have frosties um cereal i have these wheat crackers we rather these ones i've got two of those just for snacking on and so forth we have one small tin of corn i was not i was really disappointed at the size of this tin actually but anyway we have a small tin of corn we have a tin of baby carrots um we have some kidney beans here over here we have some tuna requested by my daughter we have um a four pack of beans and under here is a um four pack of spaghetti we have heinz mayonnaise guys we do love us mayonnaise we have some pasta here some wheat pasta right here we have cravendale milk it's what we would normally get again for snacks i have potato waffles kylan really likes these everyone really likes these for a snack also for a snack we have some salami right now on to the meats so we got some 
mince meat we have some diced beef right here and we have some chicken breast fillets i didn't expect this to be so small guys but anyway we have a prime beef roasting joint here thought i'll give that a try for one of our meals we have frozen breast chicken breast fillets here and then i went crazy on the fish guys because i feel like we don't eat enough fish so we got a four pack of smoked haddock we have fish pie mix i've never actually bought this guys fun fact it's skinless and boneless but i thought we will try it we have six most smoked fillets here bassa fillets then over here we have four wild pink salmon fillets then here for just a snack or maybe even a meal we've got some chicken strips over here we have our non-bio parcel this goes in a flash guys we're constantly washing clothes the children rathers get some mozzarella so i've got some grated mozzarella guys we normally get um cheddar cheese and i always get cashel like i said in my last haul so that's that over here we have some fish fingers 28 breaded fish fingers again that's snack purposes this is for just a quick meal when i'm not in the mood to actually cook we have um four cod fillets in there then over here we have two white part baked baguettes i got these guys because we're getting a bit fed up of bread and rice so this is just you know so we can have a different variety i guess and then we've got two garlic baguettes here i got a large yorkshire right here aunt bessie's of course and again so that we're not so much on the rice and other and pasta and so on we have eight um tortilla roll and um, wraps i mean we always get that when we want a little bit of a change now over here guys i went ham over here with our smoothie stuff because it is coming to spring now and we love a smoothie so we have some blueberries here we have a packet of frozen strawberries raspberries we have um orange the orange one smoothie mix which is pineapple papaya and mango i'm really excited to try this we have um because i've got all the rest before but not those we have pineapple chunks mango chunks and i didn't know they done this but they do peach slices now so the peach slices and the smoothie mix i'm really looking forward to trying because they're the two we don't normally get down here i've got all my vegetables and fruits over here guys so down here we have closed cup mushrooms we've got a packet of six british gala apples we've got some easy peels some fresh carrots these can be to snack on guys or um because my kids love to snack on carrots with hummus and so on or obviously to cook in a meal i didn't bother get a huge salad selection guys so i decided to get this which is just a half a salad selection pack so i've got this i'm not too happy of how small the lettuce is however anyway we have these british white potatoes some sweet potatoes right here 
we have bird's eye garden peas and broccoli down here we have some fresh lemons i use lemons for lots of things guys especially like in my little ginger and lemon mix with honey and apple cider vinegar it's really good for you and just if you want some warm lemon or cold lemon just to drink really good um we always get that we have some avocado up here we have some nectarines which looks kind of oh actually they're quite soft right here we have a melon we've got some pears I have a big bag here of vegetable mix. I've got mixed seedless grapes, which is, you don't get much, but it's green and red grapes. And then I got just the red as well. Right, and over here we have green beans my dad fun fact my dad used to grow these and we used to pick them in the garden and um i used to enjoy do, um you know prepping them with my dad anyway green fresh green beans there we have some cauliflower right here a nice big one over here we have carrot cauliflower and broccoli which is again a bit of a mix for a meal kiwis of course some bananas to go in our smoothies of course uh, what else we have we have this stew pack which you get i think you get a turnip onion carrots and a parsnip and then over here is a bag of onions. Right guys, I hope you was able to see all of that. I was trying my hardest for you not to see the mess of my sink. It's not too bad, but still. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and pack these up guys. Then, what's the time? Then it will be time for me to get myself completely ready for work. I am ready. I'm wearing a bodysuit right here. I've got my trainers and my tracksuit bottoms on as well. As I said, I just came back from the gym and work. So I have jumped in the shower before the shopping arrived. So I am good to go. I just need to fix my hair, make it a little bit more decent and put on my work jumper and I'm basically good to go okay guys so that's my haul I hope you guys enjoyed I'm not sure if I'm gonna add another clip to this possibly so because this might be a bit short if not stay safe be safe and forever peace bye guys I'll see you on the next clip or I'll see you next time stay safe guys bye hey guys welcome back this is a few days later by the way hence my hair has been washed so yeah how are you guys i've just come on here to see how you guys are um there's not really much to report I'm afraid. Sorry guys, I'm just using this cream right now because my hands are ashy. This cream is, yeah, Luxury Bathing Company. The Luxury Bathing Company. Kylan actually bought me this um, for Christmas. It's one of the things that it came with. Where's the lid? Yeah, so how is everyone? For me, there's nothing much to report, you know. Life is just life. I'm just living in this life, you know. Getting on with it. 
Um, I've taken on some more responsibilities as far as work. Um, a few more hours has been offered here and there. Um, I don't know if you don't know, there's a lot of school striking going on. My school, however, remains opened. And um, I think we have a day of strike, but us as a company will still be working with the children that parents still need to go out and work, I guess. So basically, I'll still be working. Um, I need the money and yeah, why not? So this is not very moisturizing, I have to say. I had to add some more. That's a little bit better. Now I can, now it's moisturizing. Just had two little there. Yeah, so nothing much is going on as far as life, you know. As you guys know, I just work, I come home, I clean, I cook, and I repeat, you know. Oh, I have been going to the gym, I'm so proud to say. I have been going to the gym, guys. As I said, I've, done, I've been doing some extra shifts at work, which has allowed me to basically do a morning shift, quite more often I was doing two days now I'm doing three four days but that's because of shortage of stuff but yeah with that said I have to I then realized to myself this is a good thing for me actually because um, it allows me to wake up nice and early crack of dawn and get my day started and on my way home from the first shift I jump into my um, gym class which has been really 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 good and very very beneficial and <clears throat> gym is not just for fitness by the way it's also for my mental state my mental health um yeah everyone knows i don't need to ramble on of all the benefits of exercising i'm sure you guys already know that all the benefits but yeah i've been enjoying that work's going really well work's going really well and um been discussing things to do with my son um, college applications which is not until next year but we're thinking in advance <clears throat> we're thinking ahead we're trying to look at colleges and see what is available in the area of work that my son would like to go in so yeah we've been doing a little bit of that as I said he's only 14 he's not ready for college yet he's soon to be 15 this month not ready for college yet but it's good to just look at things in advance so that he has some sort of a direction as to where his life is going in the near future anyway Besides that, I've not really been doing much and there's not really much to report. You pretty much see my day to day. You pretty much have seen. And if you haven't, please refer back. I've got thousands. Well, not thousands. That's exaggerated. But I do have quite a few videos, um, you know, of a, obviously centering around my lifestyle so I guess you lot have seen all my cleaning cooking I don't really show you guys I don't really do a cook with me would you like a cook with me um 
I plan to do some quesadillas today and um, have that with some salad on the side. I was thinking of filming that, but then I changed my mind because it's going to be pretty dark by the time I start cooking and it's just not going to be very good footage with the really poor lighting that I'm already struggling with. Yeah, so we're going to have that for dinner. Um, everyone is home. Everyone's in their appointed rooms, just relaxing and chilling and getting prepped for the week ahead. Um, yeah, I've just hung up my washing, and my work uniform and so forth. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. You lot have seen me do all my cleaning. You lot have seen me doing my organising. You lot have heard from me about my financial state. You lot have um, heard me say, yes, I do work. I work Monday to Friday. I am looking to... I am actually looking for more of a weekend job i'm hoping to get a weekend job just to bump up my little coins as much as i can um yeah i would like it to be in the dance sort of thing because we don't do dance in my workplace and i would love to do that again so yeah i have been looking at different options haven't come up with anything yet that really sticks out and jumps out to me but you know I'm patient I'm working I'm surviving it's fine I can take my time with this second job and I'm I can afford to be picky let me put it that way I can afford to be picky when trying to find my um <clears throat> when trying to find a second job but on saying that i'm extremely tired quite a lot i do i do enjoy you know being home so yes home is my happy place so, you know, the thought of not having the time with my son is a little bit of a, uh, as far as that. But we will see. We will see what happens in the future. But for now, I am just relaxing today. You know, I've been watching some really interesting TikToks. In fact, my son was in here not long before I went in the shower to wash my hair. And I think he got absolutely fed up of the content that I seem to watch. But I find it very interesting. Um, I like to watch a lot of, um, you know, TikTok commentary, basically people that's uploaded basically stitches on certain TikToks, mainly to do with race topics. I find it very interesting to listen to young people, older people and all the in-between, their different opinions um, on certain subjects, especially as far as race. So I've been just engrossed in doing that today and obviously having a shower and washing my hair and doing my daily things as well as, you know, um, washing my uniform and so forth. But yeah, I just thought I will jump on here because I'm not sure in the first clip, I'm not sure how much of your my shopping you was able to see. Um, I hope it turns out fine. I hope you still enjoy it. I don't really tend to tell prices of each individual item 
um, you know, I know a lot of YouTubers, you know, they'll buy, they will do hauls and tell you every single price. But when it comes to groceries, I just don't think it's that interesting to know how much I paid for my carrots and how much that loaf of bread costs. And I don't think it's interesting when it comes to like clothes and shoes and, you know, electrical appliances or Christmas presents, birthday presents things like that that's more fun isn't it it's just more fun so people tends to want to know the pricing on that well how much did you get that for for and where did you get it and things like that so i tend to do pricing on that but as far as groceries i don't find it very necessary let's say anyway I feel like I've just jumped on here to just ramble. I was made to make myself a coffee, which I haven't yet, but I will. I will make myself a coffee. Um, yeah, as soon as I come out from here, I will make myself a coffee. And I don't really have much going on. And the thing is, I don't get comments guys I don't get comments of any requests requesting me to talk, talk on a certain subject or um, they'd like to see you guys would like to see me doing a B or C I don't really get that so I kind of just wing it I'm not gonna lie I kind of just wing it I kind of just see it as okay I have a shop coming let's do a haul or okay i need to organize some stuff or clean my home or or whatever let's do a clean with me so that's pretty much how it goes um i think i've done a morning routine once i've never done a nighttime routine i don't think but then i feel like is morning routines and nighttime routines even trending anymore? Does people even care, you know, of what creams that I put on my face and what, what do I do to prepare myself as I leave out for work in the mornings? And does people care what my nighttime routine is, you know? What do I use in my shower and you know what what kind of pajamas am i wearing and like do i read before bed and you know it's kind of boring and if you're me if basically what i do in the mornings and the evening is pretty much you know morning routines and nighttime routines it's pretty much the same as you guys nothing special at all I just don't feel it's very entertaining, not to me anyway. I used to like morning routines and nighttime routines and I used to watch them a lot, but I feel like that's fizzled away now. No one's really interested in people's morning routines and nighttime routines anymore. Um, but yeah, on saying that, I actually don't know what my small little audience um wants to see basically i'm hoping that you guys still tune in because you find my content somewhat entertaining on some type of level um or just a little insight into my very boring life you know because <laughs> my life is boring guys it is pretty boring you know i'm not one to i'm not we're not a traveling vlog so you're not really gonna see lots of travel for example which is hugely exciting i really love travel vlogs by the way 
all the different places people go to and so on and so forth but I'm not really a traveler like that so you won't really get that here um, I'm just your ordinary mother to be honest with you I'm just your ordinary mum that just does ordinary things you know nothing special at all I mean I feel like however my hair videos seems to outweigh any other of my videos for some crazy reason I feel like people rather's me showing anything that I use on my hair, how I take care of my hair, um, you know, my whole natural hair routine seems to get a lot of views compared to, well, not a lot, for me a lot, but it's not a lot. I would like more views, but yeah, more views, should I say, than say me sitting down like I am today just talking to the camera like you know people seem to enjoy that more but I feel like again it's very boring because my routine for my natural hair routine pretty much does not change at all it's pretty much very much a routine i'm not a lazy natural by any means i'm definitely not a lazy a lazy natural i do all the steps and i've shown you guys by the way if you are interested and you haven't watched any of my hair videos please refer back but please go ahead and show my other videos some love my cleaning videos which one of them is coming up guys i hope you guys show this one some love because i done this at night it's a night time late night clean with me and it was pretty late let me tell you i actually show you guys the time that's coming up that will be my next upload for my Wednesday clean organize and repair so that would be coming up next so please be on a lookout for that and show it some love because I actually worked hard on my my video and my cleaning videos I don't know I feel more proud of them I don't know it's because I get joy in cleaning and I get joy in organizing and repairing and you know it's really nice to do all of that share it with you guys <clears throat> in hopes that someone actually learns something or cleans along with me or enjoys the music or enjoys um just any aspect of the clean with me or any type of cleaning organizing and repair i feel like that is pretty much my niche i made my wednesdays be specifically for those videos because i feel like that's my niche that's that's something that i enjoy doing you know my hair routines is pretty much the same and it's pretty boring to me and you know it's not as enjoyable to film as say my cleaning like for example i was not going to even come onto the camera today well well i was actually because i'm going to upload you today but um upload for you guys today but what I was going to do is wait till cause my hair is deep conditioning right now. So I was going to wait till I finished deep conditioning, rinsed out my conditioner and I was going to chit chat while I style my hair for the week in my protective style for the week. But I decided not to. Number one, poor lighting and we're about to hear lose some light soon 
Number two, um, yeah, I feel like you guys have seen that before and if you haven't, it's there if you need to see it. Um, just go back to my playlist and you'll see, I think I've got a natural hair on my playlist. Um, yeah, I just don't find it to be very interesting. Um, I feel like my Sunday vlogs, my, you know, family stroke, just me doing whatever, it could be fitness, um, it could be um, just talking like today, it could be um, hauls, I mean I do enjoy hauls though, I do enjoy doing a, a good old haul, um, but those things are not as, doesn't require me to do as much I don't feel they're pretty easy to do whereas when it comes to cleaning you know you have to get the angles right you have to move around and make sure that your you know your audience you guys can see exactly what I'm doing um you know the editing takes a little longer on a cleaning video it does take a little longer but I actually enjoy editing. I do enjoy editing and I'm learning more and more about editing because I'm a newbie to this to this editing world. But um I do enjoy the editing part of things. I know a lot of bigger YouTubers that's got more demanding audience that wants to see a b and c and they do daily vlogs and so on they get sick of editing i hear it all the time from other vloggers um other family vloggers that how it takes a lot out of them but because i guess it's just a one-man band here which is me I actually do enjoy it. I enjoy it. I really do enjoy editing. Um, yeah, so the, the thing is, I don't really get a lot of comments of anyone telling me, oh, we'd prefer if you done this, or we'd prefer if you do that, or could you show us more of this, or could you show us more of that? I don't get that at all so I basically just film what I want to film really and on a Wednesday I feel like my Wednesdays are a little bit more structured because you know it's clean organize and repair so you know it's it's just more fun i think and that's why i decided to split my days and make that specifically on my wednesday because i just have more to do you know i'm a little bit like my father in that way he was always having things to do around the house repairing his cars fixing the roof, doing things in the garden, um, just all the time there was always something to do and I find that that is so true. In your home, everything is going to always be a mess, you know, you're going to clean up and then say for example you've done your kitchen and you've done a clean with me on your kitchen, it's obviously not going to stay like that forever like you know it will get messy again and you then can do another clean you know there's always something in a home to do i feel but out and about and doing other things is just not as enjoyable and i'd like to do a more shop with me but to be honest guys i barely hit the shops these days you know i go to work 
I go to the gym and I come home and I do what there is to do at home pretty much. That's pretty much my boring life. So yeah, there's just, there's just more to do at home as well as you feel more comfortable in the privacy of your own home because it's your home. You see what I mean? So I would like it if people did tell me what they enjoy and what they don't enjoy, but I don't get that. So I'm free to do whatever I enjoy. Um, yeah, so I feel like my Sundays, which is today, my Sunday vlogs are withering just a little bit because I lead a pretty much a boring life there's only so much of my lifestyle you need to see I'm obviously not going to show you every single aspect of my life but on a Wednesday is entirely a different matter because I can just go for it there's just so much more that I can do on my Wednesdays clean repair and organize than on my Sunday, which is really just more free, I suppose. It can be anything. It can be involving my children. It can be involving a day out. It can involve fitness. It can involve morning routines, I guess. Um, it can involve them sort of things, but I feel like I've done that. Do you understand? I've done that. So you do tend to, you know, run out of ideas after some time um, as far as showing your lifestyle, especially if you don't want to show every aspect of your lifestyle. Like, for example, I'm not going to show you every aspect of my kid's life. I know there is some family vloggers that doesn't mind showing all of that, but, you know, I'm not going to use my kids, especially Kai, who is a kid, my other two is grown. I'm not going to show you guys everything because that's online. That's for anyone to access. And I don't want to exploit my child and use him as something to vlog, you know. So I feel like my Sundays are becoming a bit mm, in that type of a way. Um, but my Wednesdays, clean, organize and repair, I always seem to come up with something. Like through the week, something happens that I have to do around my home or order something for my home to repair something in my home. And so it's so much easier to come up with these ideas. So yeah, I'm on the struggle bus as far as everyday vlogging compared to Wednesday clean, organize and repair. Yeah, it's a bit of a struggle to come up with different ideas, guys. It is a little bit of a struggle. Um, I'm not going to lie. It is a bit of a struggle. And yeah, I feel like I'm a little bit getting a little bit, you know, it's a little bit static right now. Anyway. I just thought I'd jump on here, let you guys know how I'm feeling about vlogging, what's going on with, you know, my channel. And I'm not sure how I'm going to move forward because, as I said, I'm not going to show you every aspect of my life. There's certain things that's just not for the internet. Um... Yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say, guys. As I said, I'm about to go ahead, rinse my hair, 
have a coffee, style my hair for the week and um, get on with my evening, making dinner for the fam and yeah, that's it pretty much. But anyway, thumbs up this video if you enjoyed our little chit chat together guys. Thumbs up this video, um, help me out if you can, if you so choose to, with some ideas that you'd like um, me to do. Um, yeah, pretty much it. Yeah, so before this you would have seen a haul, by the way. You would have seen a haul and as I said, I hope you was able to see all the items um, because with my camera, I can't see what you can see. <laughs> so when I'm filming, it's very hard for me to manoeuvre, you know. I do not have an actual vlogging camera. I use my GoPro and unfortunately it does not have a screen to show me you know the angles very well but i do in some time in the future the very near future hope to treat myself to an actual vlogging camera um I don't know when that's going to be. As you guys know, I'm trying to take care of my finances. And these cameras are expensive. They're expensive, guys. They are expensive. I just don't have the funds to do that right now. So I choose not to do that at the moment. Um, and that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I don't know. Hopefully next Sunday I've come up with a nice, big, nice, different type of a vlog for you where I'm just not sitting here and chit-chatting, I guess. Um, yeah, but how that will go, I don't know. I'm also meant to be doing some online courses right now but I'm gonna wait and do that later so yeah that's for work purposes by the way um so yeah that's all I have guys I'm gonna love you and leave you I hope you enjoyed the food the the grocery haul everything by the way was brought in Iceland if you live in the UK you know what Iceland is um yeah so that's pretty much it yeah anyway i'm gonna go guys because i'm just rambling now all right so that's kai in the background he's on a game stay safe be safe peace guys till the next time hopefully we can come up with something anything <laughs>